Messi. Oh, Fevre looking for a move down the inside of his teammate. A little bit of a love tap possibly in that left-hander. As uh, Tonkov got out of shape on the approach. Just coming down the hill, Fevre here. Kevin Strygos was so fast through this part of the track in MXGP race one, swinging it round the outside and just not backing off. Just Jeremy giving himself. Horbeck said the same thing. He said he couldn't believe the way the, stri the speed Strygos was carrying through that section, especially because yeah. he landed in the bumps. Yeah. But he's just landing offline out of those bumps and able to carry that speed. Fevre, yeah, he oh. got out of shape. And I was about to say Fevre. And uh, obviously he getting pitched over the, uh, the jump there. Just saw him out the corner of the, uh, the camera just before we switched the corner. And Fevre then out of sixth place. So the biggest talking point of the race so far, Adam, because uh, Roman Fevre, who was third in moto number one, now at risk of not getting on the podium. The second fastest rider on the track has just made his second costly error of the moto. Yeah. Bars bent as well. As he dropped down there, I just saw the back end getting out and it just started to lift as we went past him. And then as we panned back, we just saw what we saw. So uh, it was a strange place to crash. I mean, unless he just got some sort of strange oh, kill. Uh, past Guio. Yeah. Tonkov. So for fourth place. So Guio then lighting it up on the slick surface coming out of that right hander. No traction whatsoever. Tonkov going through in a fourth. And he's now the lead Husqvarna rider in this MX2 race two. Fourth place, Paul, you've got your mound of papers here. Is that going to be a personal best for Tonkov this year? I don't think he's had maybe a top five, top six at best.